Inside the atrium for the library, you will encounter a huge mural, 25 feet tall and 74 feet wide, commissioned by the Committee on Art and Public Places and funded by the Glenstone Foundation in honor of Charles Gwathme, architect of our library, and the Abbey Memorial Fund for Mural Painting in America of the National Academy Museum and School of Fine Arts in New York. Matt Mulliken painted this site-specific mural entitled L'Art d'Ecrire in French or The Art of Writing in English. In 2004-05, after having been chosen from a pool of 70 artists, narrowed to three finalists. This artist favors grids of visual information that communicate with assertive graphic presence and limits his colors to black and the three primaries, as well as occasional green or white. He chose yellow for our site because of its compatibility with the pale white Vermont maple that predominates throughout the atrium. Physically, the three large units are made up of 64 canvas panels mounted on invisible aluminum frames. A viewer will immediately notice that Mulliken combined both familiar and esoteric imagery. The French title alludes to the centrality of language study at Middlebury during the academic year, both here and abroad, and during the summer language schools. The artist appropriated many of his visual images from the famous and deeply influential 18th century encyclopedia compiled by Denis Diderot and Jean d'Alembert. From the central panel, Mulliken included images borrowed from the history of the college incorporating floor plans of the library itself. The murals program alludes to its surroundings and the activities that take place within the library on a daily basis. The left panel is devoted to the human brain and the physiology of learning. The central panel places Middlebury College in the context of worldwide education. The right panel refers to the physical elements as well as to materiality in general. Mulliken's integration of images cannot be explained by a mere list of illustrations or catalog of references. His digitally generated images take on the aura of old master mural painting with their intellectual illusions, just as the artificially roughened surfaces evoke the appearance of mural paintings of the past.